You got it, Jude. <laughs> okay. Good morning from the North household. So right now the kids are doing school. Even Jude just finished theirs because they get on it like the moment they wake up. And I think that's it for right now. Andrew's at school, Daniel's at school. That's what we're doing for right now. Um, I will also tell you, so this is the thing. We came back from traveling, we had a million things to get done and we just kept putting them off because we had other things we were getting done. And then once we realized we were gonna move in the fall, we were like, oh, this shouldn't happen before the move, like getting an RV and changing our van. And also um, we needed to get a third car. Elijah is getting his driver's license in a matter of days. And we've been driving what we consider the teen car. It's our old Honda Civic. So we knew that would be the teen car, but we didn't wanna get our adult car to replace that. That's a smaller car until after the move. And so we, you guys watching the channel are like, man, they're doing tons of stuff. It was kind of like this backlog of things. So we did get a third car last night. We got a Nissan Pathfinder and it is going to be delivered to us today, I think, unless we go pick it up. It just, um, they needed to like kind of detail and get it ready. So we're happy about that. Uh, we wanted a car that could, nest, not, not as big as the van, but that would seat more than five, so that if we did need to go somewhere with, you know, six, five kids, um, we could do that. So the Nissan has the third row bench, and so we're pretty happy with it. People in the back there. Okay. All so right. the car is here. Everybody's pretty excited. Mom, um, how many cars are we going to get? <laughs> Good question. This is our last we're car done, we're getting, man. okay? We gotta sell that thing. Then we got the teen car in our in our new van. This is the adult car. So we got a Nissan Pathfinder, and we this is not an ad. So remember how we talked the other day? If you were watching the video, how Elijah is going to turn in his application to be a missionary in a couple months. The local church congregation will sign up to feed him usually. Um, so we feed the missionaries so that we can take the burden of dinners off of them. So they get fed as much, it's not always, but we, the, the local congregation or ward tries to give them dinner every night. Tonight we signed up to feed the local missionaries. They're girls, two girls, so we call them sister missionaries. And they're coming over to dinner. I thought of making something really healthy and then I remembered that they have not eaten at this local Italian pizzeria yet. And so we thought of just getting some of that and bringing it home. It's like the best pizza ever. It's so good. And they actually are getting transferred to a different area. So we thought, well, that might be kind of fun to let them try it. So I think I actually just will pick up that pizza and one of their yummy salads. It's the best pizza, huh, Esther? Yeah. And Esther doesn't like pizza usually. Yeah. This pizza is unlikable. No, no, no. <laughs> unlikable? Im impossible to not like. What would you call that? Ununlikable. Ununlikable. <laughs> this pizza is ununlikable. So uh, we fed the missionaries for. We've just never showed on the channel, but I figured we'd show it today. And then um, that's it. So we're gonna go drive around in the new the new car and get Elijah some some skincare products at the CVS. So let's go. Okay, we got the sister missionaries. Hello. Okay, you guys introduce yourselves. I'm Sister Westling. I'm Sister Mika. Tell us where you're from. And together we are. Okay. <laughs> I'm from Spokane, Washington. I'm from Salt Lake City, Utah. Awesome. Okay. So we're going to go by that pizzeria and pick up some of the pizza and some salad and go home and fill the... I don't know. I couldn't think of anything funny to say. <laughs> Eat! This place is so flipping good. I'm so excited. So I love this place. It's so good. And then they have all the other... I 
screamed about this pizza when we weren't living here. I couldn't wait to get back and have it. Mommy, what? My altar. You turn the music off? Yes. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Come on over. We're going to have a prayer on the food and eat some pizza. What else do we have? Salad. What else? Peppers? What else? Sauce? What else? Water? Okay. Nothing? Nothing? Yeah. What else? There's nothing. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So are we missing anybody? Are you missing me? Nope. Okay, right. that's everybody. Where'd you? I would have filmed dinner, but we like that tore through that <laughs> like we were people who hadn't eaten in years. And it was super good. Okay, so everybody just left for the activities at the church, except for me and Jude. So we're buddies tonight, and Jude wanted to wipe down the benches, and I just wiped down the table, mm -hmm. and then we'll sweep, mm -hmm. and then we're gonna have some hot cocoa. Mm -hmm. And then we might watch a movie. Oh, okay. You're so cute, Jude. I love being your mom. And I love you. Are you almost done? Yeah. You're you're really cleaning in there. I think you don't need to. <laughs> Do you want to come choose your mug for your hot cocoa? Yeah. Okay, come on. Our our mug collection's pretty dismal. Which one do you want? That one was the present. So this one, the Christmas one. Good choice. I think I'll have the dad one. And mm -hmm. it has the gray. Yeah, I like my name. Oh, it's, yeah. treats. Yumma yumma. Let's go enjoy it at the table. Maybe we should sit outside. Mm -hmm. I see the moon. Oh, you're right. The moon's up there. It's not even dark. Why is the moon up there? Okay. Jude and I chose to come down further so we could look at the woods more. Mm -hmm. Up there it was hard to see the woods. It's nice down here, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Jude and I enjoyed sitting outside so much, looking at the woods, that it made us both kind of want to go explore. And everybody else has gone exploring, not everybody, but most of the other kids. But Jude hasn't gone, and I haven't gone. It's a little, you know, late, but I think we have a few minutes still to kind of explore. Okay, let's go in. I think the best way into the woods, the kids always seem to go over this way. Well, most people go down there. But... They go down that way? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. Be careful. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> so Jude and I figure we can follow this and we'll get there. I'm not going to get back home. Oh, we will. This is just your first time exploring in the woods. You'll be fine. 
Let's make sure we stay with this creek though. It'll lead us right to the river. I think the river is right ahead. It's all green over there. Yeah. Yeah, it's over there. You can hear it, huh? Mm -hmm. And this creek is taking us right to it, right? Mm -hmm. Watch out for mud though. I see it's getting muddier and muddier. Follow me. Ooh, look at that hole. What do you think that's for? Mm, I don't know. Maybe a snake? What? A snake? What does a snake look like? A snake? Looks like a stick. But <clears throat> soft and wiggly. Oh, snake. oh, it's so cool looking. It looks way better than I thought it would. Oh, it's so pretty. Let's take a... Let's look at it. Oh, it's pretty, dude. I didn't know it was so pretty. Whoa. I love it. It looks so fast. It's awesome. Let's go this way. Wow, it's pretty. Oh, it sounds like there's a duck right there. Yeah, it kind of looks like a duck, but yeah. it's just a piece of wood. Yeah. Look at this big rock right here. Yeah. Right here, I think we should go down on it. That's cool. Okay, I had no idea the river was this cool. Yeah. I don't know, I just kind of imagined a mud creek. But this is so pretty and magical. What a great place for the kids to play. And it's just a few minutes. Put it in. Oh, here it goes. Wait, wait, here. Uh, uh. going away, my dad. Not going back home. This stick is going to the river. Cold? Not cold. Okay. Oh, I think it feels cold. <laughs> it's not cold. I think it's super cold. What? Oh, that's good. Wow, it's so pretty. That looks like a Yeah, it's a it's a tree, and that's part of like the tree trunk right there, I think. swimming hole. I would have died for this as a kid. Uh, you got another stick? Don't go with that hole. Okay. Okay, that one's going to get pulled in. Uh, I can't see it. It's coming. Which way? Which way? Oh, it's a big one. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Oh, here it goes. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa right on out. I'm going to find a good stick. I gotta find a good one. Okay, I found a huge stick. <laughs> it's here. We're gonna throw this big papa in. I pressed it. Okay, go. Wait, it's gonna come. Watch me. It's going. It's stuck. What? Okay, we're gonna leave this beautiful spot, but I will definitely be back. That was so pretty, but Jude's getting a little nervous. He feels like it's getting a little late. And the sky is pretty pink up there. Whoa. Okay, the sky is getting pink, so we better go. Whoa. You got it. Do you want my help? Here. It is very slippery, you got it? There you go, you're doing a good job, boy. Whoa, you got it. I don't know where I'm going. You got it. This is all part of learning to be an explorer. I don't know if I would have put that leg first. Here, put that, bring that leg back down. Yeah, there. Now climb up with the other leg. Yeah. There you go. Good job. Look at the pink sky up there. That's pretty. Yeah, it's a kind of light. Yeah, it is. A so, Jude. What do we need to remember? How do we get back? Uh, we need to follow that creek, right? Yeah. Dude, do you know what those are? Footprints. From what kind of animal? I don't know. You don't? A bird? No, that would be too big for a bird, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. So what could it be? I don't know. It's a deer. What does a deer eat? Uh. 
boys. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. It just eats like leaves and grass and stuff, just kind of like a cow. Uh, Look where the tracks are going. There's still more. Look, they're right here. They're pretty okay, fresh yeah. too. It's uh, almost like it was here. Wait, there's no house. No, that's not our house. Look at it. Oh, look, there's another kind. What's oh, that? I don't know. Uh, oh, it's a dog. But I don't know what that is. Oh, you know what? That's a boy. <laughs> there's the toes and there's the back of the foot. There's a dog and there's deer tracks. It could have been a girl, I guess. That's a kid's feet. But you kind of creeped out. Yeah. You seem a little creeped out. I'm not going to get back home. We are going to get back home. <laughs> This is just Jude's first exploring trip, so he's a little nervous, but we're going to be just fine, Jude, just fine. There's our house, which Jude is happy about because he thought we were never going to get home. Did you think we were going to have to live in the woods or something? Um, yeah. <laughs> we have to sleep on a tree. Sleep on a tree? <laughs> yeah. That wouldn't be very cozy. <laughs> yeah. You don't have any pillows and no blankets and nothing to hold you up on a tree. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're just fine. You got it, Jude. <laughs> we're back home. Yeah, we're back home. We get back home. <laughs> You're crazy. Of course mommy take care of you. Okay, let's hang up your jacket. No, and then watch a movie. Okay. Can we watch a scout thing? A scout? Yeah. You mean like um, the learning ones? Yeah. Okay. I look like I have a beard. I know, I always think that with this little There's little like microphone a little cover. microphone cover on here. Which I don't know if it actually works. Whoa. You said it did. Here, I'm going to show you guys. Uh, you're pulling the... Look. Uh, wait, there, see? I got a beard. Sorry. Um, anyways, anyways, how are you guys? It was so sweet and so happy and so restful for me to spend the evening with Jude. He was so fun and we cleaned up together and we danced and we had caught cocoa and we went in the woods. It was really fun. It was really sweet. So that was the end of the day. What did we even do today? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, we got a car. Got a car, and then just... Seems like we did something else that was important. I don't know. We uploaded a video. How's oh. that? No, um, so today, like I said, we, we, we kind of realized we double booked. So we're gonna have our friends from Ireland come. They're the best. And my brother's gonna come one night while they're here, so we'll have like tons of Weston, people in the house. who you yeah. have met. Then they'll leave and we'll have the day after they leave, we'll go pick up the RV. So the day they leave, Mike's flying with Elijah to Utah to get his driver's license. Then they'll fly back that night, same day. The next day we're going to go pick up the RV. Then the day after that, I think Weston's coming back through and same for the weekend. So I am not an incredibly like patient person when it comes to getting things done. I would just want to get them done right away. Right. You and like so... To um, I'm really patient in other areas of life, though. So you're, everything else, you're super patient. It's just that I'm one so thing. I'm so patient. We are going to have to wait to get it all jazzed up. It won't be done before our first trip, the maiden voyage. Sorry, I don't think we have time. Um, yeah, so that was hard for me to realize today. Like, oh, I, because I was planning that I was spending next week doing my thing. And then I realized that we have other things. We'll be doing different things. I will be doing my... You'll be doing things, just different things. Yep. And then the week after that, it's is it possible? That we have that week. But you we're know leaving, I'm going to start We're leaving start that by... Saturday. <sighs> Let's go through the things we want to do this oh, RV. Oh, no. Do we we want to redo right the now? floor. We want to paint every square inch of that place. Really? Yes. I didn't know that. You didn't? Well, I didn't realize. I guess I didn't think about it that way. Like. Yes. Because last time we actually didn't paint everything. And we only painted the main living area and I always regretted that. Okay. We need to put some new furniture in there. We need to get new bedding. I wanted to kind of, I really did want to put up some wallpaper. 
You shouldn't be telling me this list, especially when it's almost 10 o'clock at night. Because anything when it gets late. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't because now it'll like be like too much. your brain. Yeah, you're right. Like Let's trying. not talk about this right now. It's fine. We're not doing any of those things. We're going to leave it completely like, alone. Okay, we're both winking. <laughs> All right. We love you guys. Have a wonderful day or evening or you're whatever. You're totally covering it is. my face up. I'm not even on I camera. really, <laughs> really want you guys to know. <laughs> I don't like a lot of attention. <laughs> Mike is just like a real hog. <laughs> All right. We got to go to bed. No, really. Now we're going to end it. Okay. Love you guys. We're ending it. And love having you along. What a fun we're having. Look at us. It's been what a fun. Three years now, which is crazy. Three years on YouTube. That's been the kids always ask me. Daniel especially is like, how long are you going to YouTube? And I'm like, I think maybe indefinitely and they're like are you gonna youtube when you're a grandma i'm like mm, probably i'll be the first vlogging grandma on youtube actually i don't no, know if that's won't. possible there'll probably be another vlogging grandma they're vlogging we just watched a vlogging grandma tonight you're right we did <laughs> that space is filled <laughs> that was my but last holdout you'll be this That'll next generate the next generation okay yeah or maybe so, two generations still so yeah anyways it's fun it's so crazy world we live in but it sure is fun Love you guys, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.